Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we're going to have two approaches to the mountain car uh, issue that a lot of people are having, which I have two solutions to this. The, th the one in the thumbnail is the one you saw above, which fails, and I'll explain why. This one succeeds in the very end. However, you can improve it as well and tweak the parameters. Anyways, guys, um, let's get started. This one fails because this one has a simple policy, very simple. It has no backup. So basically, when it goes up to here, it starts to fall down and doesn't know what to do. That's because it has no real policy set. Basically, that one just has uh, Boolean logic. It's good, but not good enough. That's just an example. Anyways, guys, if you guys are new to my channel, be sure to uh, check out my other videos as well. Um, I've got something for everything. I got a few reinforcement learning videos, including the last one, which is the cart pole. I got it to, with the simple Boolean logic, basically, to stand up by itself. And I've got a deep Q learning video for the blackjack. And I've got a Markov's decision process for the self-driving taxi and is evaluated before he even is visualized in the game. Yes, and uh, he completes his task with very few penalties and time steps. Guys, remember, reinforcement learning, if you guys are new to it, can be used from automating trading, which I have one reinforcement learning for trading also. It can also be used to self-driving cars, self-driving drones like uh, Israel did. Anyways, guys, um, reinforcement learning is its own branch of artificial intelligence. Also, guys, one thing I wanted to share with you is... Uh, uh, if you guys are new to my channel, is I also got a lot more um, videos, ML pipelines, AI web apps, you name it, I got it. Check out my channel. Everything from AWS SageMaker pipelines to just models itself. And then the SageMaker pipelines are getting models approved for productions. And also I've got... Um, all kinds. I got database videos with SQL queries. You name it. I got an AI uh, basic convolutional neural networks, turning them into web apps with streamlets. You name it. I got it. Check out this channel. And also, if you guys are uh, been here for a while, feel free to share it too. Um, you know, the more people you can uh, get on my channel and help, the better. Um, anyways, guys, um, let's get started. Install these libraries right here. Import these libraries. Okay, and then we're going to check the registry, and here's what I want to show you. You can do this one also, and you guys aren't going to have to install anything other than this. A lot of people are having issues knowing what to install. Well, if you use Google Colab, this is all you got to install. If you use Jupyter, you might have to install it in a virtual environment. I'm not sure. I don't use Jupyter. Anyways, guys, um, this is the environment registry. So these are all the games that Jim has left. Yes, Miss Pac-Man is not in there, as you can see. It used to be. The taxi game and the blackjack and the cart pole version zero are the ones that I got on my channel. You would pass those parameters and apply the code as needed for those videos if you want to copy them. Anyways, guys, Acrobat, you can pass right here. Some of them you have to delete dot environments. Anyways, guys, some of these you have to install Fujiko, and some of them you have to install Box2D. Uh, Frozen Lake, uh, there's an issue with displaying it. I was going to do that one. Just to warn you guys, the environment observation space, the environment action space, look at it. Okay, it's discrete. Okay, and guys, remember, reinforcement learning is a reward system of penalties and rewards. You usually want to penalize more than you reward so the agent doesn't get lazy, but you want to give them a little breathing room.
mathematically and uh, realistically, they go hand in hand in this. And we got to set the policy. Why? Because he's got to know what to do in case, you know. The agent's got to know what to do, you know, in case something doesn't work like you showed out, like it's shown down there. Anyways, guys, you guys can add more episodes, change the discount, but you guys are going to have to change something down there as well. You can add the learning rate if you want to 001 also, if you want. And then the Q table, MP random, you guys got to do that. You guys can change the high and low parameter if you want. And then uh, import a Maggio and... Uh, Get the discrete space. Remember, we're returning a tuple as type np integer. Okay, the np argmax is the greedy function, remember? And then we're showing everybody and then render equals true. Get the discrete state equals environment restate. And then np argmax is the greedy function in reinforcement learning. It's also used for computing labels and... Machine learning as well and deep learning. MP argmax. Just like MP argmin, you can compute the threshold in a prediction. Anyways, MP uh, max, you guys can change that right there if you guys want to improve the model to argmax because it's the Q table we're talking about again, just like in the action. The new Q, the max future, yeah. You guys might want to change that to argmax to improve it even more. Um, the discrete state, the Q table. Anyways, guys, um, as you can see, this is all you need to set the policy. The policy, basically. So the agent's got an idea what to do when he goes up the hill. Remember, guys, he's uh, underpowered. And uh, it's a very steep hill. So when he goes down because he can't go high enough like in the other one with Boolean logic, he's got to get a good idea what to do instead, you know. I'm already down. What do I do? What do I do? Well, this policy gives him a good idea. And then remember, we're printing out the episodes. You guys can change. If you guys don't want it to say congratulations, you guys can have it say something else as well. Change it right there under the print for the underneath the new state. Anyways, guys, um, tweak the policy. And remember, the policy didn't have a penalty, so I added it right here because I decided to do a penalty for um, this Boolean logic just to show you. If you guys want to implement the penalty into this policy, you guys can do that as well. And then there's something else I want to show you. And then the discount, you guys can change that also, like I showed you. Um, environment render. This is to visualize the game. Remember, action equals two for that Boolean logic, the one that failed. And did kind of didn't know what to do because it didn't have a policy when he went down the hill after going so high. The thumbnail is the one you saw where he went, the, the highest he went. Else equals one. Environment step, action, render, RGB array. Okay, remember guys, um, we're displaying everything. And he's still going. But he's got a policy. If you guys want to add more episodes, you guys can. Remember, we added discrete state, new discrete state, and the penalty. The new discrete state's already got the reward system in there. So you guys, if you guys don't implement penalty in there, you guys can implement it down here like I showed you. Done, info, environment, step, just like up there. Episode range, because that's how many episodes. If you guys increase the episodes, increase it here. Display the output. Environment close, if done, break. Anyways, guys, um, I hope you like my video. And uh, remember, guys, uh, tweak the code. Make it better than mine.
anyways, guys, um, share my videos. Uh, I would appreciate that so more people can learn. There's a lot you can do. And uh, go off on your own. Play with it, you know? Increase... And then add more episodes and then describe how much you want it to show. And then, uh, just like I told you, some ideas. The MP argmax, the greedy function. Okay. Now, um, I don't recommend changing that, obviously. You guys know that just by looking at it. And then the range of episodes, I don't recommend you change that either. Anyways, guys, um... If you're new to my channel, um, check out my other videos like I was telling you. I've got nearly everything. And also, um, don't forget about that reinforcement learning for trading. Um, yes, that is used today. And also, uh, check out uh, my videos at the very beginning for uh, Google Cloud deployments as well and natural language processing. I've got sentiment analysis web app as well and basic just sentiment analysis itself. If you guys want me to do a certain video, please leave a comment telling me, you know, so I've got a good idea what my audience wants. Okay, so like if you liked it, subscribe if you want, and uh, share if you want. Thank you, guys. Take care. Until next time, bye.